Hi, I'm John Burnham, editor of Cruising World. Well, I'd like to welcome you to Cruising World's adventure charter in the Galapagos. We're aboard the beautiful old ship Alta, which is taking us to a series of these volcanic islands over the next several days. Last night we motored from San Cristobal in the southeast here to Genovese, which is in the northeast, and we actually went from the southern hemisphere to the northern hemisphere. We're 12 miles north of the equator uh, this morning. We awoke here in this beautiful caldera, which is a cone of an extinct volcano. All around us we have the rim of the cone of the volcano, except uh, you'll see there's a break, which occurred probably a million or many million years ago. We spent the morning uh, looking at birds, we saw boobies, red-footed boobies, Nazca boobies, frigate birds, and uh, behind me there are 200,000 pairs of petrel on this island uh, working the cliffs. This is a yellow crowned night heron. It feeds at night, but it's juvenile, so the crown isn't yellow yet. My underwater video wasn't brilliant at Genovisa, but that's a hammerhead shark in the frame. Uh, just tell us about tell us about what we're going to see tomorrow, oh, okay. tomorrow uh, on Monday. Morning, we're going to visit uh, Fernandina in the morning. Fernandina is one of the most beautiful islands. It's my favorite island. It's a really volcanic island. It's the youngest island in Galapagos. It's almost half million year old. It's a beautiful place to see a lot of iguanas. Then we're on a walk along the shoreline. It's beautiful to see the uh, flightless cormorants. It's the only place in the world where there are flightless cormorants. What other kind of animals? Will we see on uh, Fernandina? Sea lions and uh, Galapagos hawk, salidite foot crabs, and a lot of wading birds too. Tomorrow is a really long day. It's a really, really nice day. That's okay. We're uh, we're up for it. Thank you.